Hi. So on WP Shout, we have related posts. Um, and this is a very common feature that people want in WordPress. And there are many different ways you can do it. Um, but I'm just going to highlight the way we've done it. So if I scroll down to the bottom of my post, um, I will see this area where it says related. Uh, the four languages you need to understand WordPress, what namespaces mean. Um, that's relevant to our content, obviously. Um, but the way we've done that is using the Jetpack plugin from WordPress.com. Um, and the really nice thing about related posts from Jetpack is that if you're already using Jetpack, you won't experience a site load. Um, historically, uh, related post plugins are pretty intensive to use because they have to uh, understand and take apart your language on your WordPress site. So they have to go through and parse all your words and see what common words were. That's the kind of way that you can actually tell whether or not a post is related to another post. Is like you find the common words in them and score them. Um, and that's just a really intensive thing for any computer to do on, especially like our site has something like, you know, 10,000 posts probably at this point, I'm maybe embellishing a bit. Um, but all of that is to say that that related post feature um, from Jetpack is a great way to do it, especially if you're already using Jetpack. And the way to find it is if you have Jetpack installed, um, and we actually have a quick guide on that if you need it, but you go to Jetpack and then settings, and then you'll go to traffic, and right here on about halfway down the page, you'll see related posts. Show related content after posts. Show related header to more clearly separate it. Use large and visually striking layout. Um, so that's the way we're doing it. If you turn off the large and visually striking, what you get is like the uh, thing that doesn't use your images and is honestly a lot less appealing. Um, we also turned on that related header, which is why when I scrolled through it, you saw that related word at the top and you're seeing as I toggle it. This visual preview is really nice. Um, it's there. And if I turned the feature off completely, then they would just be gone on our pages. Um, so that is the Jetpack related post settings. I honestly find it to be the easiest and best way to do related posts in almost all situations because of that server load issue I'm talking about. Because in this case, WordPress.com's servers are doing that processing for you, so you don't have to. Um, so that's really uh, how to use Jetpack to get related posts on your WordPress site. Hope it's helpful.